seated here with our next couple, Susan and Kurt. And Susan, something happened to you, right, during this proposal period? What was that? I went blank. Completely blank. Totally blank. Totally. Name, address, gone. Everything. People <laughs> I knew, everything. Well, you were so surprised that you actually didn't even recognize a picture of someone that you know very well, right? Right. And this picture was not just like a snapshot. No, it was a billboard. It was me. Billboard. You, big, <laughs> blank. Right. Good, good. Let's take a look at this, all right? The rain is just stopping as our story unfolds, and that's a good thing, because we've set up our proposal to take place on this outdoor restaurant balcony, three stories high. Linda, Linda, Linda. Susie, how about you sit right here? That's Susan in the yellow blouse, and she thinks she's here to have a leisurely lunch with her friends, who are both in on it. Kurt is across the street, disguised in a wig and glasses, posing as a member of a billboard crew. I'll be right back, sir. So, while Susan is settling down for a relaxing afternoon, across the street, Kurt is ready to swing into action. Should we toast? Yeah. I think that's a good idea. Well, maybe. <laughs> Susan and I have been going out for a long time, and been she's basically wanted to get married for a long time, and I've been, like, non-committal. So I figured it would be, since I made her wait so long, she deserves the most outrageous thing I can provide for her. And so I had an opportunity to do this, and uh, decided to go for it. Remember that Susan thinks Kurt is over 400 miles away at home in Phoenix, working on his hobby of repairing sports cars. Susan has yet to even glance across the street, but all that is about to change in a matter of moments. Is this a like seafood? No, that's zucchini, cheese, and chicken. I wonder if we can get a vegetable platter. I'm sorry, but let's eat this. I'm going to get some of these. Not an awfully easy individual for us to live with. I've got a lot of strange idiosyncrasies. I come home from work and work in the garage all night, and she's very supportive of a lot of my hobbies. Uh, I think one of the most important things is we laugh together a lot. But she's somebody I can definitely grow old with. Susan's friends, Linda and Beth, are both doing a great job of carrying on a casual conversation, even though they know what's coming. Oh, wow. I think she's going to love the billboard. I'm looking forward to seeing her facial expression when she sees all this set up. Really? She's a quesadilla. You're a quesadilla girl. Oh, look at the mural in there. They did a great job. This is a unique place. That looks. It looks like me. I does look like you. I know. I wonder if that's my niece, Kristen. Is she mom? Did you mom like? That's so bizarre because the last picture I got taken, my hair was that long, and I got it taken with my dogs. Really? And it was like, do you have one? That is bizarre. Oh my god! How weird. It's too weird. It's too weird. I'm say, freaking oh, out. So <laughs> and now, the big moment. No, not that I know of, but she's up in the north west. And she knows what she's doing. That's what oh my she's god, like, my heart, that is too much. That's How many margaritas did you guys have? <laughs> <laughs> what, what exactly were you doing that night? <laughs> hey, lady, what do you think? Look good? What are you doing? I am so freaked out. What are you doing? Came to visit you. Get out Come of here. here. Come on. <laughs> Hi, sweetie. That looks like me. Does it look That's like you? What are you doing? What are you doing? Ah, I'm so freaked out. Good. For six years, we've been going out. And you've been like hammering me to marry you for yeah. a long time. And so I wanted to do something really special for you. And we've had a really good year this year. And I've taken a lot of risks. And oh, wow. I've had a lot of great things happen to me. And John and Jeff and Mark have all convinced me that the biggest risk I'm taking is losing you. 
I can't believe you. <laughs> Will you marry me soon? Yes. Oh, I know. <laughs> That's so shocked. I can't believe it. Oh. I love it. You're a riot. You're great. Jesus. I gotta tell you, that was so much fun to watch. It's so great. That was like an ending to a great movie, except I'm glad you guys made it down from the cherry picker to be here tonight. <laughs> You were never convinced that was you in the picture, were you? No. No? No, I wasn't at all. And you were great. You were standing with your back to Susan. I was going, turn around, fool, wave to her. I didn't know what was going to come with this. It was great. Yeah. She, was, she was astounded, and that was the whole idea, and, and I, I loved it, and it's the best thing I've done in, in ages. Congratulations, Kurt. Congratulations and best wishes. Thank you.